God is good. Today I am in the city giving away free clothes. Got rid of a lot. Probably almost eh, about 100 outfits. That's a problem we have today in this world. You know, a lot of us women are very privileged. Privileged women um, like us that have too many clothes, that cry about wanting new clothes and want new things. Sweating balls. I'm out here whew, in Southeast DC. This is where I'm from, born and raised, over at the Harriet Tubman Women's Shelter here, where this is the part of the city that has not been gentrified. And a lot of it is not like the rest. And there's a lot of people in need. So I put out garment rack with whew, my whole, almost whole wardrobe, but summer wardrobe. Uh, my best friend. So I'm going to sit in here in the vehicle because, let's see, my little Range Rover air conditioned. I've been out there sweating, just hanging up the clothes, boxing things up. Due to social distance, I got to stay about six feet. The lady informed me that came up and grabbed clothes. She said they had tested us for COVID in there too. And I had let her know I had been tested negative. Uh, that was last Sunday. Anyhow, that's a different story for another time. And um, just very thankful. Thankful to be out here. Thankful to be alive. Thankful for a vehicle, for air conditioning, the things we take for granted, water. Um, just being blessed. Today also marks five years. I shared my experience with this lady that it marks five years since I was in this situation, this very exact, did not, I can't compare my experience with anybody else's. I had escaped domestic violence with my son's father and had been um, despair, displaced, distraught, uh, homelessness, a lot of struggles until um, I really got myself together. If it wasn't for God, God first and foremost, that had blessed me and still continues to bless me every day. I thank God for 